I did what we all want to do, but probably shouldn't do. Respond to a message from a salty pirate. This message was too good to pass up. Let's jump into it. All right. So normally I don't respond to messages uh, from Facebook or YouTube or anything because, you know, people get a little salty. You steal their treasure. They get a little bit angry. But this one, this one intrigued me because it's different than the ones that I normally get. I was curious. This guy struck my curiosity. So with that being said, let's jump into it. This is what the message said. I got cheated on Hippo TC stream a few days back when I was paired with two brand new that day random players, which he called a good crew due to my cosmetics LOL and a server glitchy server. I got clips of their cheese. I love cheese. I was curious. He hooked me. It's like, what, sir? Whoa, what, what cheese? He continued. Well, if he would have hung around for five more minutes in the server my crewmate would have been there and it would have been on but hippo left the server so he took to hourglass and destroyed fools letting them know you hippo were the cause of their pain all that pain is on you hippo privilege to win and then he sent me this picture so i was curious i said send me the receipts i want to see to which he ignored that and sent me this. That's what I did, sending you the picture. I have video of my encounter with you while I rock two brand new players. I just want to face you when I have my crewmate and not brand new knobs. I added you as a friend, but if you never intend on sailing with us sometime, then we'll be removing that. Heavy insulted that I was referred to as Ramsey's ghost with your name hid. Still, don't understand why you plan so hard to steal a chest of legends when I know you must have millions like us and own everything. You doing that for views? And the whole Jack Sparrow fight to run away? Come on, man. It's obvious after fighting you that you have benefits. Why aren't you fighting instead of fighting run away? That is lame, dude. So I don't know what he was referring to as far as like benefits. I think he's accusing me of cheating. Anyways, this is what he said further. Why fight to be Sparrow too? Thought you were hit, Bo. Anyway. We are hunting you now, and others will pay in your name until that day. But you are concerned three. More important things will while we wait. If you care to see what we are about, you are invited to sail with us on a day of your choosing. Whether you take the opportunity or not, we will still going to hunt you. I'm working on a video now. Might add your clips depending. That being said, I am a troll by nature. So I responded with this. Oh, my friend, you ain't never, ever going to catch me. Now, he didn't particularly like that. And that's fine with me because he said this. What a pity. I expect a little more excitement out of you. Thought you for sure jump at a chance to face your villain in a friendly challenge. But what do I know? And what do I find in a hero's place? This pirate who just wants to run and no fight. Saddens me, but I understand. Not the first to get excited about running away when the skelly's out. Well, I guess I just stopped yelling out to the boys in Hourglass. Hippo, I know that's you. Because I know it won't be. Pretty melodramatic. I guess heroes can just be regular guys too, right? Didn't mean to scare you, little fella. Suddenly, my fotage doesn't feel so important. I mean, what's the point in trying to build something amazing with a hero that that runs away from the opportunity? No heroes I see would give you the threat to get you next time and all that, but just doesn't feel like it matters. Keep running, I guess. I'll save it for blurbs, LOL. Well, good luck with that blurbs because I think this guy's coming after you next. Now, in all seriousness, I don't remember this guy at all and I have no idea what the encounter is that this guy's talking about. So this is what I said. So to be fair, I don't even remember fighting you. Sounds like I fought and won. You keep saying that you got clips, so I'd be curious to watch the encounter. All this sounds like ramblings of a salty pirate who I stole a chest of legends from. You would think by this point in the conversation, which was going on for a couple days, that he would respond with me the time and the stamp and all the stuff of when I fought this guy, but still nothing. He said this, give me one second. I got a lot of clips to dig through. I don't use Twitch much at all. I YouTube. Pretty sure that was you in the picture. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mr. Hippo, I'm not a big time streamer. I'm not even a big YouTube channel. 
but my guild was a guild before guilds were a thing and it's important to me i'm on here every day mr hippo tc and i have seen a thing or two and learned a thing or two but you were something new eating super fast avoiding stuns i can't do that i used to quick swap and it's supposed to be banned and you're like fast as hell 91 still try what the what the what i'm controller and laptop no macros no any of that i work for mine i fight warriors and hourglass daily i'm not salty about losing or going to deny it i have a few three minute clips of our encounter it's not all exciting i was going to cut it up but not take away the fact that you beat us me and my newbie randoms i'm not denying it at this point i don't know what to say because i'm confused I want to know what this encounter sounds like an epic fight sounds like something that we fought for a long time on truthfully i have no idea well i do now but at this point in the conversation I had no clue he continued and said this i got a video of me and you sword dashing each other you budding boarding my gun acting up my channel might not be almighty like yours but my channel is important to me well awesome well awesome man i have no disrespect for you and your channel i get it rock on no disrespect sir i have some good video of our encounter you and your buddy join the galleon with me and my right hand and have a discussion with me we will settle things in a friendly rivalry never seen before i'll put it all together and send you once it's finished if not cool that doesn't really help me none i'll just make room for the men of hourglass what say you i promise what i'm talking about has never been seen before and then he sent me this picture that honestly is kind of terrifying. I would hate to be on the receiving side of the cursed captain. Yeah, that's me. And apparently that's when I was killing this guy. I think I shot him with my flintlock. He was very angry. Again, I followed up with this guy begging him basically at this point, sir, send me the clips, the timestamp. I want to see for myself. And I sent him a message. I said, but when was this? What day in timestamp? Finally. He sent me the day in question, the infamous day when I ran into this salty pirate. 8, 22, 24. As soon as I finally got the information from this guy, I went to the clip. He gave me a timestamp and a day and I went to it and I remembered everything. This is actually how things went down. See, this whole time I thought this was one of those guys that I memed and just kind of ran away and went through the portal because, you know, never ever gonna catch me and all that. That's not what happened at all. I was talking on this guy's brig, and then me and Isaac pulled this off. Here's what, here's, yeah, tower. here's what we're gonna do. We're going to harpoon that keg. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a hard left turn. We're gonna defend the ladders. We're yeah. gonna pick up that keg and then drop it in front of that tower so we can hit it with the cannons, yeah? Yeah. Okay, here we go. I'm, I'm going fast. Okay. Can you watch ladders I'll harpoon? On the other side. Enemy here. Oh, the skeleton knocked me out. Okay. Okay. There's got two people behind the boat. Might be a little too close, unfortunately. Maybe the good. Guy's gonna be boarding on the left side. Dead. I have shots. I'm not gonna help you. Uh. Two dead. Okay. They done. They done. They done. They done. I don't know where the other guy went. Uh, in the tower. In the tower with you? I I left the tower to come join you, but he's up there. Cool. If we go up together, we can get him. Okay, yeah, let's nice. do it. He jumped down. Oh, I'm he gonna die here. <laughs> GG's guys, let's go, bring the boat. <laughs>
so not only did we absolutely sink this guy and destroy him but these guys came back and this is what happened when they came back yeah hippo just sank uh the brig that made me rage quit cheers you're welcome yeah they are i don't know what they're doing they're one sail up okay they're waiting for you i think Right. It'd probably be best to go east, right? That's the direction the wind's taking us. I would like to go that way. Okay. Yeah. Once they're committed, I would start turning around a little bit. Yeah, turn around. Turn, turn around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. May my chain shots be true. And may I not suck. one hit second one hit glorious they are suffering from damage Got the other one. bailing water okay i'm gonna go to another tower now hopefully there's more cannonballs hopefully <laughs> they are struggling <laughs> oh did we sink them <laughs> got them let's go <laughs> <laughs> that's hilarious that's some good that was some good baiting right there today right now mm -hmm. Uh, so we have an opportunity to get this break if we want, or we can turn hard right and go sell. We should two. definitely go sell first, and then I would go okay. for that. Okay. <laughs> yes, yeah, thanks to two years. Swamp, thanks to two months. I get yeeted to. Sharkington, leave me alone. Hey, the guy's rude. Yeah, they just run to sell. Oh, that's 100% what we're doing, guys. We're going to go run and sell the treasure. GG's. But we did sink you twice to be fair, so it's not technically running. Te technically. After that, we did what any reasonable pirates would do in a situation like this. We stole the treasure, we defended the treasure, we sold the treasure. These guys still wanted us dead. They came at us another time, and this time they sank to a skeleton galleon. And it sounded like they got new crewmates in or something like that. I'm not quite sure. To be honest but then this happened I, i'm good with whatever you would All like right, to do i would here. definitely maybe do something with their you got cheney's oh yes sir they're about to get hit by the um got it did you really hit that damn sir nope okay i'm gonna catch wind i might go for a board here yeah i'll go with you I'm gonna go starboard side. I'll get port. They're gonna try to board. Maybe. Somewhere. I need board. Left side. Hippo! Hey, hey. Oh, my bad. Hi, Isaac. How y'all doing? Good morning. Uh, 
What's up, guys? Oh, aren't you some garbage? Aren't you some garbage? <laughs> Yo, GG's, guys! I love you! GG's, you're garbage. Dude. I, I am, I'm trying to get good! I that you. dude like six times with the sword. You got sunk by garbage! You got sunk by garbage! <laughs> six times with the sword, man. Long live the sword! <laughs> so here we are. Sank this guy three times in a row, accusing me of running away from the fight. Now, all three times, we didn't even sink him with our boat. We just, he just sank. We used the, the kegs at the fort. We then we used the fort towers. I mean, it's kind of like, what, sir, what are, you, what are you talking about? All this being said, the conversation does not stop here. He sent me more and a lot more at that. He said, they called me Ramsey's ghost. I guess I was the black skelly and the captain of the silver goldfish. Got a never before seen idea. I would really like to run with you. If you would join me on a galleon with my right hand, you and a pirate of your choice, no tricks. I promise never before seen. It won't be stressful. It will be fun. And once you know anyone can do it, a chance for you to one up me at my own fair game. If my crew loses, I will personally fetch you the legend chest. What say you? To which I said, brother, I remember this. We destroyed you three times. To which he did not like that. Said this. I have multiple three minute clips of it all from my pont of view. You beat me with the crew of newbies and far from destroyed me. I was glitching like crazy and still was taking it to both of you. To which I said, sir, you, you sank multiple times. I killed you multiple times. It's a GG's brother. We stole your treasure, defended ourselves and sold it all. Your version of events is simply not true, but I like your role play. And for that, I give you a GG. And honestly, that's where the conversation should have ended. If it did end there, I probably wouldn't be making this video, but it did not end there. He sent more. You should really consider my offer, man. You would enjoy it. Something never seen before. Really? Never before seen? You sure? I said this. Nah, I'm good. We meet again. Keep an eye on your treasure. Maybe next time you will be able to defend it. Okay. Well, sorry things couldn't work out. I and hunt me all you want, but you ain't never ever gonna catch me. Again, good point in the conversation end. Nothing but GG's. But this wouldn't be a salty pirate story if there was not more. So he sent more. This is what he said. You pass on something nobody knows about but me. I won't waste any more time on you. Go ahead and run. Run? Sir, I sank you three times. I said, ah, you scurvy dog. Though again, you say I ran, but clearly from my stream, I fought you twice, sank you twice, and managed to sell all the treasure. So it's not running if I sank you. Now I'm going to meme you if we run into each other again. So best of luck out there, you scurvy pirate. To which he said... Go ahead and meme away. I thought you would like to show your audience something they'd never seen. That was me doing you a solid. Okay. My channel isn't big. No one would notice on mine, but that just tells me all in due time. In a friendly challenge, you turned it down. Your loss, whether anyone else knows or not, I know and you know you run. I will show my crew the video clips of your shenanigans so they can see what I'm talking about but then they will be deleted to make room for clips of those worthy to be on my channel. After talking with you, I kind of feel bad for you. My chasing you is over, so best of luck to you, runner. What? Until you have sunk me and my right-hand man, brag all you want about sinking me on the brig with brand new newbies and two randoms. Honestly surprised you find it such a victory knowing this fact, but whatever floats your boat, your victory is hollow and without substance. All you can say is you defeated me with randoms and is all you have proof of. And you can't even say that because you hid my name. I gave you a chance to rectify that and you spat at me. I, I, I don't remember spitting. Enjoy your hollow victory. Unlike you saying I'll never catch you. When you grow a pair, you know where I'll be. And also my version is false. Mr. Block my sword attack while you're shooting a pistol. You ain't legit. I captured a whole lot of your bull 
Anyone that sees is gonna know your cheese, because we all know pistol don't block sword. And that's just one of your cheeses. Honestly, at this point, if you're playing Sea of Thieves and you think this game works smoothly all the time, every time, nothing but all the time, then you're playing the wrong game. I mean, for goodness sake, this happened to me the other day. What the? How are you hitting me? He is using his mind. That is cheating. Stop it. <laughs> what the hell is happening? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand yet. I'm being chased. Oh, there's more. I, I don't know what is happening. I am so sorry. I'm gonna put them out of their misery. Ah! The game's not fine. And it's not in a good state. Most people just teleport around now these days. I thought somebody in Hourglass would at least understand that, but no. He continues. Everyone knows about Rare's pet being acquainted with unstable servers. The bad part is you actually think it makes you good knowing you do. I watch your stream, so it's, see, I seen it from your point of view. Server was just peachy for you, while everyone else was struggling. Dude, straight up, I used to be a fan. Kinda. I might have watched a stream or two, maybe. Can't really remember any, but I'm sure I did. I heard the rumors. Now I've seen it. Not impressed. You are still a runner. Accept my challenge. Prove me wrong. Or are you a coward? This is a lot to take in. Sometimes when you open the can of worms, you don't know what you're going to get. And I, at this point, didn't know if this guy was still RPing, salty, accusing me of cheating. I don't know. But there's only one meme that comes to mind or one image, and it's this. That's how I feel this guy is typing. Anyways, I sent this. Sir, in all seriousness, I wish you the best. At first, I thought you were doing a bit of RP and Sea of Thieves. But now I see you actually are just another salty boy, upset that you got sunk multiple times by a pirate who memes. You will never ever catch me and i will forever haunt your pirate dreams and see if thieves you will forever and always know that you almost caught the cursed captain you will also know that i stole your chest of legends and on that note i wish you irl the very best much love and i'll see you on the seas thought that was a nice message i don't think he thought that glad you love me and all and i know you didn't put anyone up to things comes with the territory salty nah I haven't gave an any thought to your chest deal. On that note, go sign a note. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Think he's thought about it a time or two since then, to be honest. It was at this point that I reverted back to my normal tactics when salty pirates send me mean messages. I said, new phone, who dis? To which he responded with the name. And I said what any reasonable person would say. Never heard of you. And he said, that's the name of the ship sunk on you. And still feeling absolutely trolly, I said, wait, are you trying to get a hold of Hippo TC? That son of a gun freaking did it again. Dude pisses people off, trolls them, and then redirects them to me. What did that asshole do this time? So I think I had him hooked here. And he says, and who are you? But unfortunately... I did not respond fast enough. And he said this. I'm so sorry he put you up to speaking with me. Such a bad hippo. I mean, hit schmo or whatever it is. See, if only he knew how truly sorry I was. I mean, I just can't control my rage sometimes. And I say things that I don't mean like hippo ain't no good or hippo privilege. See, I just can't help myself. Is that jealous bone? See, I don't want to be original or have anything clever to say. Like my hero, hick toe. I mean, he just copies a gimmick to the point he thinks he's the gimmick. And wow, I mean, I wish I could function on a low level and yet believe I was great. Wonderful delusions. But unfortunately, rim shot or hip replacement, whatever his name is, I just can't be mad. I mean, he stole my one and only chest of legends ever tears. Couldn't even wipe away the tears. I bawled so hard. I wish I had hit on me to be like the great Jack Hit Row and run away from a challenge. What is it? Fight to run away? Keep telling yourself that, runner. I'll be fighting. See you soon. 
I was looking for a friendly rivalry with a kisser of sparrows, not strife, but I get it. He don't know how to step outside of the mask. Been wearing it for far too long. Really do feel bad for him. That mask must be heavy. I'll leave it at that. There won't be no preparation, no longing for battle. I wish you luck on your endeavors, genuinely. May your laces never untie and trip you, runner. But this is where I'm ending things. You'll never get the chance to fight my crew. May your victory always be hollow. Cheers. And there you have it. This is probably a great reason not to respond to salty messages from salty pirates. But at the same time, it was kind of awesome. I wasn't sure. I'm still not sure, honestly, if this guy's RPing, if he's actually angry, which I think he is. Because he also accused me of cheating or using macros or cheese or something. I don't know what. But this guy, I feel like, is going to hold a grudge. That's fine with me because there's a lot of people out there that might want me dead. But I will say to him what I have said to many other people. You ain't never, ever, ever, ever going to catch me. See on the seas. And let me know your favorite part in the comments below. Much love, everybody. GG's.